been a while. <laughs> We're currently shooting some ASRV content for you guys while on this hike. It's our way of multitasking, getting outside at the same time, some active recovery. We're in this like slot canyon. Just getting our steps in. Um, we're gonna hit deadlifts later, but we figured we'd take you through a vlog, day in the life type vibe. Yeah, there's just some things that the treadmill cannot do, and sometimes even running in your local area cannot do. So if you have the luxury of trekking out different spots, getting a change of scenery, definitely refresh your take on cardio, your take on recovery. Everything doesn't always have to be go, go, go. Sometimes it's just about moving and enjoying the little things. And this is today's kit. I'm rocking the brand new adventure shorts from the Summer 22 collection. These are in the Canyon Rose colorway and I am wearing a size small. I'm 5'9", 165 pounds. As for the top, I'm wearing the Outlast half sleeve t-shirt in black, also a size small. So pretty true to size on these fits. So just know that the adventure shorts do run bigger um, because they're recreational based. Uh, they're tetra light material, supposedly a hybrid short. You can go swimming in them, which I have tested and they feel great. And the stretch is awesome. You see the mesh on the side here, pull my phone out. Boom, it keeps it secure. And then what I like in particular on this one is that the drawstrings are on the inside of the shorts. So it's a nice clean look. And the bucket hat, you can't forget the bucket hat. Yeah, so first impressions of these adventure shorts, I've had them for a little, little over two weeks. The black ones I've pretty much been wearing daily to be honest. Um, I didn't get the chance to surf in them just yet, but I did wear them to the pool and they were more than enough. The only petty issue I found was the mesh pocket area would catch and fill up with a lot of water, but what shorts don't do that that have pockets? Other than that, the um, fit of them is great. They don't slip down, so you don't have to worry about losing your shorts. And this Canyon Rose color is nice, especially for the summertime. Summertime vibe. Canyon? Canyon Rose in a canyon? <laughs> it's like we planned this. Now we're gonna go up north and get some foodie grub on. We've been craving this spot for a minute now, and it is hot pot. If you haven't heard of Boiling Point, you're about to see what it is. If you have, stay tuned, because it's gonna be awesome. This is exactly what boiling point is. Oh, you, you excited? So excited. So it's a Taiwanese hot pot. We both got beef bowls. You guys can see the fire underneath the bowl. If you guys have never had this before, definitely recommend trying it. For my spicy lovers out there, this place is 100% spicy. So give it a go. We got some fish cake, shredded beef, cilantro, corn, and then some tempura, which looks like that. So it is. We get it with some extra beef and pork belly. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Oh, it's so yummy. Ooh. Oh, that looks delicious. Okay. Let's go, baby. 